All right, so I found this really cool cave. Check this out. This cave is right here, just to the west of Lookout Landing, which is the first place they send you to when you get off the uh, newbie isle. So it's right here. It's a really cool cave. Definitely come check it out. Let's go in. Let's see what's up. We can see we got some kind of goblin creature, which is a new model. Looks like a couple of them hanging from the ceiling. What is going on in here? I'm going to shoot that one down. What is happening in here? All right, let's get ready for a battle. Oh my gosh, she's climbing on the ceiling. Okay, all right, all right, all right. What in the world? Oh, oh, he's attacking me from up there. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, he moves a lot, too. He's hard to hit in the head. Oh, another one. Oh my gosh. He's gonna run me out of here. Throwing rocks. Well, these are some wild guys. All right, let's get out a bomb flower. There we go. There we go. Those bomb flowers, man, I love them. Horriblin. So those are called horriblins. A horriblin horn. I like that. Oh, oh, there's another one. Horriblin claw. Oh my gosh. He's a wild one. He's a wild one. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I thought it would knock him off if I shot him. It's in fact, not true. All right, we know what to do. Boom. You do have to make sure you are a little back from that bomb explosion. It'll get you too. All right, we have unlocked the treasure chest in here. What else is in this cave? So every cave is supposed to have that frog creature, which drops some kind of rare item. Do we have anything with the rocks who can blast? Let's take a look at everything in here first. Okay, what, what, what do we got here? How do we get that down? Maybe burn it? Let's try to burn it down, make it drop. Use our fire fruit. Catch it on fire. Nope, that didn't work. Hmm. Oh, oh yes, yes. Our ability. Let's see if this works. Yep, yep. There we go. Go right up through here. Right through those bones, apparently. Alright, grab bright, ooh, bright bloom seeds. Those are good. Bright cap. Cooking a dish for a glowing effect to anyone who eats it. Oh, we can glow. If we add that to our food, that's interesting. Alright, now we got all that. Let's keep looking around. Let's go and grab this treasure. See what's in it. And we gotta go through that wall over there. Spiky Spear. That's uh, eight. We'll replace. Well, we need that one. We'll replace this one. What is this? Another bright cap. Another bomb flower. Very good. Knock one of these lizards off. Okay, now. What do we got? Oh, there he is. There's the frog. There's supposed to be one in every single cave in this entire game. And you're, I don't know why yet, but I um, haven't played long enough to know. But this item he drops right here, the booble gin. Very important for something. And that is it. That is... You have defeated the cavern. And Tears of the Kingdom. Grab all your loot, look around, but that is this little small cave. And I love that Tears of the Kingdom is just full of really cool little small little dungeons and caves. Some are bigger than others, but you go in, you figure it out, and it's just a good time. And they are hidden and tucked away absolutely everywhere in the world. And it's a joy to explore. And, of course, you get lots of... You can do lots of mining down here. You get your boobles and lots of other treasure. It's a lot of fun. I hope you're enjoying Tears of the Kingdom as much as I am. Lots of tips, tricks, walkthroughs, and guides here on the channel. And until next time, my friends, God bless and happy gaming.